What up guys, it's Andy back with level one and today I'm reviewing another headset and it is the Plantronics Rig 400 LX. Um, pretty cool looking headset right there right off the bat from the box, you know. Um, Plantronics announced back at E3 in um, 2017 that they would be partnering with uh, Dolby Atmos uh, to create like uh, the headphones with the Dolby Atmos surround sound and let me tell you this partnership paid off very well because i really enjoyed using this headset and i probably use it more than any other headset now um yeah so with this actually comes with a code for the dolby atmos surround sound which is 14.99 by itself but you get it with these uh headphones which is pretty awesome um you can use Dolby Atmos with other headsets, but you have to pay $14.99 and you have to have a headset that supports it, obviously. And you obviously have to have the support for it. But right here, great pair of headphones. And they actually look really cool. You know, I really actually do like the design a lot. Um, I got tangled up here. How did that happen? So this is what they look like and they are really cool. I like the design a lot. You know, they're pretty wide and they're all plastic made out of like a hard plastic and usually plastic headsets, they feel kind of cheap, but this is actually really sturdy and really solid. This does not feel cheap at all. Um, you can adjust it um, pretty good. You know, you can bring down the headband and move it up. But also what's interesting is they created like this rail here on the side and you can actually pop out the ear cups and move them up or down. And if you have another Plantronics rig headset with the rails, you can actually pop these ear cups into that headset and use that headset. Um, they're really comfortable though. This is probably the lightest headphones I've had all year. Like this is probably the lightest headset. And... It's really soft and they don't pinch at all. I've played for hours wearing these things and they just feel really great. After a while you don't feel them, you don't notice they're there. And I reviewed a couple headphones this year that are really comfortable but you know, after a couple of hours they do start to pinch or you start to feel it in your ears. And with these I didn't feel that at all. Um, the mic is noise cancelling and removable so you can actually hear yourself a little bit in the background so you're not yelling like a madman in your house while you're gaming one issue i did have with the mic is i feel it's a little too short like when you put it on uh it's right here but if you have it a little bit away from you uh people will have trouble hearing you like you have to bring it curve it in a little closer which is kind of a little bit common sense but you know sometimes you just throw it on and uh, you're like, I'm back, and no one can really hear you too well because it's too far away. But if it was like a couple centimeters longer, I feel like you wouldn't have that issue. Um, other than that though, they're pretty great. They're really awesome. They have 40 millimeter drivers, so they're pretty loud. The bass is really strong and really loud. Um, even though it doesn't like distort the sound, clear treble you know like it's really clear and really good even watching um movies on it netflix actually does support uh, adobe atmos so watching netflix with these things they actually do sound really great um it's just a typical 3.5 millimeter uh plug this is the adapter for xbox another issue with this is that um it's for xbox as you can see it comes with this but it doesn't come with a splitter for PC gamers for the for the uh, microphone. So you do have to have your own splitter. Even though it says Xbox and Windows. Which is a little bit of a drawback. But most gamers already have one so it's not too big of a deal. Also you're saving money with this because the Dolby Atmos is $15 itself. But it comes with a code for that. And this headset was only $100 on Amazon. Only a hundred dollars and you get a pair of really light, comfortable, great sounding headphones with Dolby Atmos around sound included. So I feel like it's a steal, like it's definitely worth it. 
there are headphones out there that cost more that don't sound as great. And for this to be $100, I feel like it's a mid-level like priced headset and it definitely sounds a little bit more in a higher tier of a headset. Like it's up there and it's pretty awesome. You know, it's a pretty great headset and it looks pretty cool. It's not too fancy, but it gets the job done. And I think uh, this is going to be a really popular headset. And I feel like Plantronics using this one got me a little bit excited to see what else they're going to be coming out with in the future. Like it made me feel like they're, they're moving in the right direction, making uh, gaming equipment. And, you know, that's a good thing, you know, hopefully at CES or, you know, E3 next year, they'll announce some new batches of headsets that'll be even better and they'll improve upon a few things that they got wrong here. But not much. Honestly, they didn't get much wrong. Just a few minor issues that that really are easily correctable and don't take away from this pair of headphones too much you know nothing that's like a real deal breaker but yeah plantronics like they really did their thing with this i really like them i enjoyed them a lot so i hope you guys enjoy them if you buy them and you should and thanks for watching all right just make sure you keep checking out the website because we got a lot of cool stuff and we're always uploading more stuff and you know CES is coming and PAX East and so stay tuned because we'll be here reviewing a lot of cool shit for you. Thanks for watching.